I would now like to show you how to actually measure numbers off one of these plots. You can just measure a plot um, by eye, bearing in mind that each of these boxes is, whenever it says at the bottom seconds, in this case 500 microseconds, and each vertical interval is in this case 5 volts, whatever it says in this corner over here. But to get more accurate measurement, press the cursor button over here, and then type off, we want type on, so this is an amplitude cursor now. It's brought up two cursors, two horizontal lines, and you can move them up and down like this. And so, for example, you can move it to the, if you wanted to work out how big the sawtooth wave was, you can move it to the top, and it's telling you um, that cursor 1 is at 12 volts. We can also go down here to cursor 2, and now we're controlling a second cursor, and you can move that, say, to the bottom here, which is at minus 11.4 volts, and it's telling you delta V, the range in voltage, is 23.4 volts. If, instead of measuring the voltage, the vertical, you want to measure a time. What you can do is type, change type to time, and now you've got vertical cursors. You can move one of them around, say, to work out where the dip is here, which in this case, uh, cursor 1 is at, um, this is cursor 2 we're manipulating, which is at 2.46 milliseconds. And then you can go to cursor 1, and move that around, you could, for example, find the period delta t between cursor 1 and cursor 2, and it tells you that in the middle there.